A bid by SeaWorld to double the size of its killer whale tanks has been approved by the California Coastal Commission despite opposition by animal rights activists. While the plan was given the go-ahead, it comes with the condition that the theme park doesn't breed any of the 11 whales in captivity in California. The decision followed hours of impassioned speeches by hundreds of supporters and opponents of the project. The People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals protest was led by actress and animal rights activist Pamela Anderson. As a resident of California, I urge you please vote against SeaWorld's Blue World Project. And Thank I you. know SeaWorld will be a thing of the past very soon. Thank you. SeaWorld disputed Peter's accusations, saying the whales at the park are not only safe, but have healthier lives than whales in the wild. The animals at SeaWorld don't face many of the factors that cause stress in the wild. And in fact, when scientists study stress, they use samples from animals at aquariums as baseline non-stress samples. Unlike wild killer whales, we provide comprehensive medical care, uh, comprehensive dental care that is primarily based on prevention. SeaWorld executives want to build two new orca pools to replace the current tank. Animal rights groups argue that the whales might have larger tanks under the SeaWorld plan, but they'd still be captive. Interest in orcas and the conditions they live under at SeaWorld rose after the 2013 documentary Blackfish.